hello and welcome back to my channel and tonight is the special night because moon met mighty jupiter yes this is not a star but it's the planet mighty jupiter so back in 2020 we observed planet mars just moving behind the moon and it was hiding for uh, two hours behind the moon so we call it as lunar planetary occultation so if the altitude is just right some people on earth may observe that jupiter is just moving behind the moon for some hours today so we are not that lucky so we are able to see the conjunction wherein the moon is just close to the jupiter so let's see how this looks through my self-made telescope so right now I have connected my telescope to my DSLR and we can see moon that's the beautiful moon and it's very very bright because sky is very clear today and you can see the beautiful craters on my camera screen these are the few craters on the north pole let me focus it Yes, this is sharp. And as we move towards the south pole of the moon, you can see the moon is full of craters. That's beautiful. And today, Jupiter, planet Jupiter, is very, very close to the moon. So if we move towards the north pole of the moon, right there we can see Jupiter yes this is the planet Jupiter you can see it's very very bright and I don't know if you can see it on uh, screen because that's a screen recording with my mobile phone and I don't know if you can see the red spot but I can see the red spot on Jupiter. It's very, very clear. And let me increase the exposure so that you can see the moons of Jupiter. These are the few bright moons of Jupiter. That's beautiful. These are the three bright moons of Jupiter. I think the third one is behind the Jupiter because I can't see any eclipse on the Jupiter so it will be behind so some part of the world may see it as a occultation wherein the planet Jupiter it's right behind the moon which is known as occultation that's beautiful so we experienced a uh, Mars occultation back in 2020 wherein the Mars was behind the moon for two hours and we enjoyed it a lot. So now let's connect my smartphone to my telescope. So I will remove the DSLR and in place of that I will connect my smartphone there and let's see how the craters are visible today and let's see how it looks through smartphone so let's get started so this video is to show you all how the live video of the moon looks through my self-made telescope so this is not a screen record like I have done before it's the live video captured with my smartphone connected to my telescope so you can see all the beautiful features on moon and there's the south pole and you can see the maximum craters there so if I magnify and let me focus in and you can see the close-up view of the moon 
so if your friends haven't seen such a magnified view of the moon you can share this video with your friends and let them amazed to see it that's beautiful craters on moon so let's see if i can find jupiter just like that by moving my telescope with such a high magnification so let's see there it is you can see jupiter with its bright moons let me zoom in let me realign it that's the bright jupiter let me reduce the iso so that you can see features on jupiter yes there it is you can see all the belts on the jupiter that's beautiful still it's getting cloudy now so you can't see the colors on the jupiter so few weeks back i have captured jupiter so that's the image of jupiter with the same setup and it's beautiful so the jupiter is moving that's due to earth's rotation on its axis so all the objects in the sky appears to move from east to west that's beautiful now the red spot is behind the jupiter because jupiter also moves on its axis so hope you enjoyed this video until next time clear skies and subscribe to this channel and share the beautiful views of moon and jupiter with your friends thanks for watching